Hey everybody, it's James. How are you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have a personal pick, and that is the movie Point Break from 1991. Apparently there are two of these, I was told, so I needed to make sure to get the 1991 version, um, which is like... Uh, they. Uh, so I was told it's not a sequel. There's two of them, and they're two completely separate things. <laughs> so I I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> so it's like a remake, I guess? I don't know. But this is the 1991 version of Point Break, and it was a private request from Steph. So hello, Steph. Thank you so much for your continued support of this channel. It's appreciated. And uh, I, of course, know nearly nothing about this. I was just told to... Make sure I'm watching the 1991 version and not whatever the other version is. And I was like, okay, well, do I need to know anything? And they shook their head at me and said, you're not allowed to know anything. <laughs> you know that. I'm like, thanks. <laughs> so, I, I, you know, I'm interested to get into it to see if it's a comedy or, you know, action or mystery or... Like, murder mystery, maybe? I don't know. What's a point break? I don't know what that is. <laughs> Usually, like, some kind of hint from the actual title of the movie. Uh, if you don't know the backstory of me, I'm an ex-farmer who grew up in the middle of nowhere and only had three channels on my TV, so we just didn't watch it. And I became a massive bookworm for the last 30 years. And that's all I've cared about is all the wonderful, amazing books that I've read throughout my life. And less about what's on TV or what actors are doing things, what movies exist out there. You know, just books were my life. Now, apparently books and movies are my life because I really love watching all these awesome U.S. movies. But, uh, yeah. Let's get into it. Point Break from 1991. Wonder if I'm going to recognize anybody. Never heard of Largo Entertainment before. Does JVC exist anymore? I think I even owned a receiver that was JVC once. Oh, hello. Keanu Reeves and Patrick Swayze together. Okay, so I know uh, Patrick Swayze from Ghost, which I just recently watched. And I know Keanu from The Matrix and from John Wick 1 and 2. And I think I've seen him in something else, but I don't remember. I'm, I'm, uh, I've seen a lot of movies at this point. <laughs> oh. Why do you have a shotgun, Keanu? Target practice. So we've got surfing and target practice together. Is that him surfing too? I can't tell if that's... Keanu or not. Wow, he's a good shot. 100% Utah! Utah is his name. Executive producer James Cameron. Oh, that's interesting. Continental. This is an older movie. They, they don't exist. Hi, Johnny Utah? That's his name, Johnny Utah. Oh, where are we going? They have a locked door. And the whole crap, a lot of security. Special Agent John Utah, day number one in L.A. Welcome aboard. Special Agent. You very well have been in the top 2% of your class. Of oh my gosh, it's the guy from um, Office office Space. The horrible boss. I'd like to make sure that all my people maintain Coming sound through. cardiovascular fitness. So I take the skin off chicken. Good man. <laughs> you do? That's the best part. And you are now in the bank robbery capital of the world. And we nailed over 1,000 of them. We're dealing with the FBI. Do you know how we nail the bad guys, Utah? By crunching data. Good data-based analysis. That's what I do, database analysis. I love these things. Hey, you're a real blue flame special, aren't you, son? Young, dumb, and full of cum. Oh, my God. <laughs> I guess we just must have ourselves an app shortage, huh? Uh, Not so far. Not so far, yeah. <laughs> he's the, yeah, he's an ass. I want to see you retrieve at least two bricks off the bottom. I know him. Uh, he's from Lethal Weapon. He was the nutcase on Le in Lethal Weapon. I have been saddled with some blue flamer Quantico cat. This ah. they pull, huh? Who's your guy? Yeah. <laughs> Hi. Ah, Pappas. Welcome to SeaWorld, kid. Welcome to SeaWorld. 
That was funny. That was funny. Welcome to SeaWorld. What are we doing? Everybody freeze! We're robbing a bank. Now, get down! What's the matter with you people? That's a very crowded bank to rob. The money's insured, so it's not worth dying for. It is insured. Just implementing our own personal plan of deregulation. <laughs> I got Nancy on the line. Ooh, oh, they pulled the die pack out. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen, and please don't forget to vote. I'm not a crook. <laughs> They're funny. In and out in 90 seconds. They're fast. We're talking about solid professionals, and they stick strictly to the cash drawers. They don't go for the vault. They never get greedy. Look at them separate the die pack. The ex-presidents are the best I've ever seen. Tell the kid your theory on the presidents. Well, let's hear it. What's the theory? Totally right, dude. So he thinks that they're surfers. Because they're like, hang 10, dude, blah, blah, blah. Let me know if you find Jimmy Hoffa under the seat while you're at it. You've been working bank robbery, what, 22 years? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So a guy with that kind of timing must have some theory about these guys. Leave it alone, Johnny. What am I thinking? If you couldn't crack it with all your years of experience, it's impossible to conceive that I might have something to offer, right? There you go. You tell him. You mad? Yeah, I'm mad! Well, since you're still alive and you're not in the box just yet, <laughs> why don't you tell me this theory of yours and we'll go get these guys? Yeah. <laughs> you want to nail the bank robbers and be a big hero? Definitely. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> the ex-presidents are surfers. Look at the tan line on this guy. Oh, there is a soil sample. Traces of oil, carnauba wax. Handle wax, car wax, mustache wax. Guy's waxing his mustache at the beach. Gets <laughs> sand in it, takes it off with a shoe. Shoe scuffs the counter. <laughs> this is one of them. Sex wax. Yeah. You're not in the kink. <laughs> are you, Angela? <laughs> <laughs> not yet. The dates on these robberies. It's strictly a summer job for these idiots. They're traveling on the money, going where the yeah. waves are. Uh-huh. Hey, man, a lot of guys your age are learning to surf. I'm 25. Surfing's a source. It'll change your life. How old is that kid? You have to get out there and learn the moves. You're trying to tell me the FBI is going to pay me to learn to surf. It's either you or me out there on the board. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, huh? Come on. You're the quarterback, Jock. Is he an actual quarterback? They keep calling him a quarterback. How hard can it be? Uh, very difficult, actually. And undertow and undercurrent and yeah. <laughs> Use your arms. Did he lose his board? You want to commit suicide, you do it someplace else. You got no business out here whatsoever. <laughs> He's just getting his ass kicked by the waves. My name's Johnny Utah. Who cares? Who cares? You almost died, Utah. That was funny. This woman doesn't look familiar. I don't think I've seen her before. He's literally like, do you see us? He whacked his head. She has a cute little car. Tyler Andicott. That is your surfing contact? God, Utah. Not bad, Utah. <laughs> oh, my. Reckless driving. I gotta find an approach. Both parents deceased. She's an orphan. Yeah, definitely. Oh, goodness. He found her, tracked her down. Why do you keep hanging around here? I need you to teach oh, me. Oh, it's been more than once. Shrimp and fries, go. To go? <laughs> You've all of a sudden got this bug that you just have to go surfing? You bet. My whole life I've done things for other people. My parents always figured I'd go to law school, so I did. So I'm a big hero to my folks, right? But two years ago, they were killed in a car wreck. Oh, this is his way in because she, her parents died in a airplane crash. I've never seen the ocean before. Good line. I want to do what you do. Good, like, setup. She's going to fall for it totally. Okay, tomorrow, 6 a.m. You agree to do exactly what I say when I say it? Sure. Start over. Do you, is the hand thing important? Both feet forward at the same time. Gotta get both your feet up there. Smaller waves, right? It's like skiing. You start on the the little kitty hill. I can't remember what they call it. I used to ski a lot. What the heck do they call it? Bunny hill? The bunny hill. Doing all right, city boy. That is a big, look at her size instead of his. That board is huge. So does the size of the board mean ease of use? Like the bigger the board, the more it floats, so it's easier to deal with. The smaller boards are tougher, but you can turn them faster. He was up a little bit. 
There you go. Good job. Whoa, dang. That's Bodhi. They call him the Bodhisattva. Well, whoever he is, he knows what he's doing. Those are some big waves. This guy's even crazier than you, Johnny. What's up? Oh, it's um, Swayze. Oh, uh, we know each other. Yeah, I hope so. That's a surfboard, all right. Looks like a 57 Chevy I used to have. <laughs> That's what I thought. Yeah, good catch. So easy. Was he actually a quarterback? There you go. Oh, yeah, he can throw. Who works here? Yeah. yeah. They're having fun. I love it. Oh, jeez. Nice. He's getting through them all, man. Get him. Whoa. <laughs> I just think that's a little out of line. Whoa, whoa, whoa. It's Johnny Utah. Oh, he knows who he is. You got nuked in the last quarter or something. Yeah, I got my knee folded back about 90 degrees the wrong way. That would do it. Went through law school instead. Lawyers don't surf. Yeah, he does. Not well. We're working on it, though. <laughs> this is not some job flipping burgers at the local drive-in. Yes, your approach to this whole goddamn case bothers me. And yes, you bother me. <laughs> <laughs> wow, he's the dick in this movie, too. You two have produced exactly squat. Does either one of you have anything even remotely interesting to tell me? Caught my first tube this morning. <laughs> we better come up with something real quick. Oh, what are we doing? 28 robberies. And what do we get from it? One hair. Oh. Lab is showing traces of toxins in the hair. If we can get some hair samples and get a match at a certain beach, we'd know which break the ex-presidents surf. Good. Buying this? No, but let's do it anyway. It will bug the ah. shit out of heart. No, yeah, there you go. <laughs> I like this team. <laughs> let's do that. I don't care if it helps. <laughs> um, that plant is really close to the ocean. You two are done making out. I need to talk to you. Make it away from a girlfriend. Did he cut my hair? This was obviously before uh, marijuana was legal. Got it. Hey. You saved your life, bro. I get what they're doing. Here's a match. Gotta go beach. Nice point break. Oh, got the title card. So point break is some type of surf reference. The point in which the wave breaks, I'm assuming. Stay off my way. They are very territorial. Paddle, paddle, paddle. Yeah, <laughs> he's even getting into it. Oh, he's getting up. Not very quick. Oh, he's gonna piss that guy off. Yeah. Valley, man. They are very territorial. <laughs> there must be 20 guys out here with ponytails. Patience, hotshot. These guys are a real tight unit. You'll see them. You'll know it. Uh-oh. That middle guy looks really familiar. That would be a waste of time. Oh, my God. That's Flea from Red Hot Chili Peppers. Oh, there you go. Oh, that board's done. <laughs> Oh, they're serious. Holy crap. Go get your partner. Oh, oh. It's Swayze. Back off, War Child. Seriously. Really glad you found me. Why? Hey. <laughs> oh, now he's going to come from and run in. A little backup helps. Oh, he can fight. Yeah, he can fight. Let's go, Utah. I swear that one is um Flea. You two guys seen a kid run through here. With a car stereo. There's four guys back there you might want to check out. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Causing problems. Who are those guys? Nazi assholes. They, uh, they think there's some kind of death squad around here. They don't have any real understanding of the sea, so they'll never get the spiritual side of it. Oh, he's a spiritualist. Having some people over at my house tonight if you want to come. Sure. Next time you leave your piece of shield in the car, you stay in sight, okay? Okay, Dad. Okay, Dad. I resemble that remark. Nine or late 70s Jeep. That's a Jeep? Jeep belongs to a bunker. Yeah. That's a old Jeep. Felony possession of cocaine. That's good. Felony B and E. Lots of felonies. These guys really fit the profile. Here comes the night shift. This is totally bullshit. See you bright and early, guys. Oh, night shift. That's not how that works. It's supposed to be down and then you go up. You can't just leave it there the whole time. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, wow. In the house? It's a party. 
Hey. Hey, buddy. Where's the salt? You forgot the salt. Watch yourself. She's a wild one. Make yourself at home. What's mine is yours. That's very nice. Mikasa Sukasa. 25 feet straight down. Pushing you forward like... <laughs> very excited about the story. The ultimate rush. Nothing that comes close to it. Not even sex. Maybe that's because you're not doing it right, Rose. Yeah. So what's the biggest? Why, man? Bells Beach, Australia. Bodie believes the 50-year storm is coming next year. That's kind of a legend. It's absolutely real. For twice a century, the ocean lets us know just how small we really are. Oh, I get that. You want the ultimate. Is he stringing a guitar? Is that what he's doing? Yeah, totally. That's how I want to go. Hell, I ain't gonna live to see 30. You're proud of that? Oh, You're too proud much of that? Yeah. Here. Come on. Your date's leaving. That means you. Look at the big shark teeth. Those are cool. Big shark mouth. Whoa, rock climbing, skydiving. Hope you're not buying into this bonsai bullshit. You got the kamikaze look, Johnny. He'll take you to the edge. What? Johnny has his own demons. He does want him to be part of his little group. Time for a little stealth mission you up for. A stealth mission. Surfing at night? You barely do this in broad daylight. Oh, yeah. Oh, so that's one way to do it. Get it all over you and, <laughs> and burst into flames. I know. I'm such an old man sometimes. I just am fairly safety conscious about my children and other people because I have injured myself a lot. I very much have injured myself because I was a young, dumb kid on a farm and you can hurt yourself pretty badly pretty easily. And I did many times. But are you crazy enough? That looks like fun. Can you see the wave though? Or do you just feel the wave? You can't see ah. out here. I'm gonna die. Get in sync and charge with it. You don't need to see. I'm pretty sure blind people have um, surfed before. I'm gonna die now. <laughs> I'm gonna die now. <laughs> Whoa, you're surfing, man. Yeah, he is. Nice. That's fun. The best on earth. He loves it. I wonder if they got to learn how to surf. Like both of like these are actually the actors yeah. versus stunt people. I just want to sit out here for a minute. Well, usually you have this intense sort of scowl. You've got something driving you. She's picking up on him. You looked almost happy. He's just enjoying the moment. Yeah. She's shivering. Look at her. Goosebumps. Yeah, she's shivering. Uh huh. I I have a very, a little fear of sharks, so I don't know. I might have a problem surfing. Oh, we slept on the beach. Do we do fun things on the beach? Holy sh! I'm really late. Oh no. Yeah, get some kisses before you run. Oh goodness, what are we doing? Look at how that car handles, man. Just every single bounce, everything is just, everything just. That's why if I ever got an old car, I'd have to update the entire suspension and drivetrain and everything. <laughs> it's so bad. Punk partner mine showing up yet? Right here. Uh huh. Now you're strictly backup. I don't want to burn your cover. Oh, okay. Yeah, good point. It's showtime. Come on, Scooby! So they're raiding the house, I'm assuming? No oh, man. <laughs> I like the Jamaican accent. Cheerios and beer. Oh, always oh, got a little mirror. Yeah, it's mechanic mirror. Oh, jeez. Oh my gosh! Look at that lawnmower. Those things are so dangerous. A rock. Someone's flying out there. Oh crap! Jeez, big guns. Get Angelo out of there. They're pulling out a ah. arsenal. I repeat, say again. Call on your copy. They can't hear nothing over that stupid thing. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. These are a lot of guns. Come to the door. I'm going to pop them up, man. Just a reminder that I'm offering a seven day free trial to new Patreons. That is where you can find all my full reactions and this exclusive content. Oh, God. Drop it. You. Oh, shoot, shoot back, shoot back. Okay, he's done. He's done. Oh my god. 
that's a that's a weird ass looking shotgun. Oh god! Oh what? I can't believe he took that shot. What is that? Oh oh the naked girl's beating the crap out of him. She is kicking his ass. Oh my god! <laughs> oh! He shot himself in the foot. What? She's just stabbed an FBI agent. Oh, oh gee, uh, through the window. That's not good. Oh, turn the lawnmower off. Turn the lawnmower off, please. Ooh, knife. Come on, do some FBI stuff. No. Turn it off. Oh. Speak into the microphone, squid brain. Why didn't you run over and turn the friggin' lawnmower off, you piece of crap? You okay? Oh, no. God. what about the poor FBI agent that got stabbed? The real cowboys, right? Batman and Robin? You know what this is? Huh? Oh, There's no. Two keys. Uncut. That of cuffs is DEA. Works for DEA. Yeah. Oh, these guys robbing Tarzana City National Bank on August 2nd when they were in Fort <laughs> Lauderdale August 2nd. Well, I guess the FBI should have cleared it before they <laughs> raided the house. I don't think it's their fault. He's got a scar on his shoulder. Five foot walls and zeros, let's go. He does this. <laughs> he does this? I don't know, what time was it? 4.35 a.m.? It wouldn't be light outside. They're all sharing the same wave? Oh, they are, yeah. It's them! It's them. It's totally them. You look like you saw a ghost. They're ghosts. Yeah, huh? I gotta go. I'm sorry, really. I'll call you later. God damn it. Why didn't you call me? You're probably halfway to Maui. They've got to pick up some traveling money first. The last time you had a feeling I had to kill a guy. And I hate that. It looks bad on my report. <laughs> I hate that. <laughs> I hate killing a guy. Tomorrow morning, first thing. It's time for lunch. There is a sandwich shop. Best I've ever tasted. Would you go get me two? Aren't they supposed to be guarding the bank or whatever? Utah, get me two. Yeah, yeah we got it. You want two of them. <gasps> There's the guys. There's the guys. He wasn't paying attention. His partner was not paying attention. There's no way. Did you see Lincoln pull up? What Lincoln? The uh, one right there in front of your face. Go, freeze! Oh, got the window. Get in. Aim for the tires. I don't believe this! You're losing him! Not losing him! Whoa! They used the all three lanes. He's still behind us! Yeah, he is. He's right behind you. But don't they have a radio? Call him for backup. If it is Bodie, they know who he is now. Watch out! Oh, there you go. Oh, crap. There, pop tires, pop tires. Come on! What are you gonna do? You're on foot? Right this guy down here. Come on. I got him. Whoa, flamethrower! Burning the evidence. Yeah, he's burning the evidence. That would be really hot. Oh, he's right there. Got him. Oh, yeah, he's right there. He's back up. He's on fire. A little bit. Shoot him. You can't aim for his legs. Oh, there goes the gas station. Holy crap. Oh, there was a cop right there. It'd be tough to run with that mask on. That'd be a story to tell. I was just doing the laundry and these guys ran through my entire house. <laughs> this is a hell of a chase. Oh my gosh. He's oh, <laughs> <It's> getting... <laughs> ah! Okay. He was getting beat by a vacuum. Oh, oh it's the, uh, what do they call that? The California River or something like that. Oh, his knee. Shoot him! He's gonna let him go. Why? Why? Yeah, his knees all I screwed up. I wanna see you in my office right now. When you shoot, you don't miss. You're getting too goddamn close to the surfing guru buddy of yours. He missed on purpose. And if I get anything that resembles your boy, I'll beef you. They know where he lives. That's your basic hit and run. Stupid jerk just kept driving. Got that look again. You're about to tell me something and then you don't. Boy, she picked up on everything. Love that. 
You act like nothing happened. He's a fuck federal agent. Yes. I say we get the fuck out of here now, tonight. They got the money. This was never about money for us. It was about us against the system. Oh, okay. We show them that the human spirit is still alive. So what's the plan, Bodie? I know exactly what to do with him. This is interesting. What path are we going down? That's not a good one. Oh, oh Jesus. I bet you lied about your parents. He did. Did your parents die in the car accident? No. Nope. They live in Columbus, Ohio. I work bank robbery. The guys I'm after are surfers. Don't you have a soul? Ah, she's so pissed. Tell her she's way. gone. I wanted to tell you, but I couldn't. I was afraid you'd leave. Good guess, huh? <laughs> Look at his uh, abdomen. He had his uh, gallbladder taken out or something. It's Bodie. Stuff on the truck. We gotta go. Life is short. Oh goodness. He knows they know who he is, right? Ever done this before? No. Guy diving. All you gotta do is jump. Don't worry at all because we're not gonna land on land. They're not landing on land. They're landing in the water. Who packed my shoe? I did what? You don't trust me? You gotta earn trust. Take mine. Why don't you take young grommets here? I'm gonna jump or jerk off. I would think jumping that for the very first time is not a great idea. Because he doesn't know what he's doing. Look at that. They know what they're doing. Wow. I bet it's very enjoyable. I just, I, I don't know that I want to do it. Wow. Is that actually him doing it? <laughs> I don't. They're having a good time. That's for sure. What? He's got flippers on. I bet that would be amazing. Can you actually hear somebody talking when you're skydiving, though? I didn't think you could hear anybody speaking. That's it, Johnny. Go for it. There they did it. Amazing. Wow, what a view, right? The guy with the flippers cracks me up. You're doing good. Pull after you. Why after you? There you go. Pull the ripcord. Jeez. Does he know how to steer? I would think that'd be dangerous, um, landing in the water with your canopy open like that. You can get caught up in the canopy and drowned or tangled in the ropes or whatever. You gotta be losing it. Closest you'll ever get to God. Johnny, come here. There's something you need to see. So they walked back to the plane? This is an insurance policy. Uh-oh. No! Fucking oh. dead man! Whoa, 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 I'm the only one that knows where she is. Let me talk. Rosie won't do anything as long as I meet him at a certain place oh in time. Oh my goodness. Six hours from now. Blackmail. Where they're going, there are no phones, so you are <laughs> out of luck. It's messed up situation now. I really do. I hate violence. But Rosie is a mechanism. He will not stop. But when three o'clock comes, he will gut her like a pig. So I guess that makes us partners. Partners for what? We're wasting time. Party time, let's move it. Um, guns. All I'm asking for is 90 seconds of your life. They're gonna make him rob a bank? Fear causes hesitation. I hate this. Tyler's gonna get killed. I am an FBI agent. Yeah. I know, man. Isn't it wild? <laughs> Isn't it wild? Why be a servant to the law when you can be its master? Whatever. You're gonna get yourself killed. No mask for you. Looks like you don't get to be president. Who's the fifth guy? The one that has Tyler captive. He's not part of the group that goes in? Rock and roll. Everybody go! Oh my gosh. I blow out your f***ing kneecaps, you'll be on the floor. Bro, TV, smile. Oh, jeez, blackmail. We are the ex-president. With a little cooperation, I won't have to blow your heads off. 90 seconds. Why are we going to the vault? Just do it! Uh-huh. They never go to the vault. They're wasting time. Lots of money. Bad idea. You're pulling too much time. Yes. Hey. I'm a cop. Uh-oh. I'm a cop. Back me up. It's all insured. There's too many innocent people, dude. Oh. Shot him. Not cover. Oh. Shot him. Oh, my gosh. Not very good shots. Oh, God, I had the... Oh, jeez, everybody's getting shot. Oh, my God, everybody's getting shot. Reload. He's gonna kill him. Oh. Yeah. 
He got shot in the throat. Hang on, man. He's done. He got shot in the throat. Uh, there's one of his crews dead. Come on, you can't take him with. Let's go. What are you gonna shoot him? Oh, hit him with the butt of the gun, probably. Uh, God damn it! Who's in charge of this camera crew? It's a crime scene area. They let people in with the camera crew? Your partner's an accessory to murder. You understand that, Pappas? Mm -hmm. Don't send him in with the black and whites like some punk. Let me write him in. Yeah, sure, Angelo. Why not? I mean, that's why I put you two screw ups together to begin with. He's a dick in both movies I've seen him in. I was in this bureau when you were still popping zits on your funny face. And there's one thing that I learned out of all these years that you still haven't got. Yeah? Why don't you astonish me, ah. face? Oh! Oh, no! Respect for my elders. He punched him out! I know where they're going, but we got one minor problem. What? We can't arrest them or shoot them. That's a big problem. Why didn't he tell all the other FBI agents, like, where they're going? Uh, he is. Right, exactly. Oh, he's behind him. Tell me where she is, and I walk away. Oh, oh he got... Oh, he's dead for sure. He's dead too. Oh my God, they're all going down fast. Oh no, he's still alive. Oh no. Oh, he's dead. His partner's dead. That's baloney. He's going to prison for a very long time. Grab his gun. Just hang on. He's not gonna live. I'm not flying you guys San Felipe, man. I'm gonna tell him where we're going. Oh, now he knows they're going to San Felipe. Let's go, man. All right, let's wait. Here comes all the cops. This is all foobar. Very low. Under the radar, probably. We're almost there. Just gotta get you to a safe jump altitude. He's gonna die. Hey, man, I'm cold. You're cold because you don't have any blood left, probably. Johnny, throw me that money back. Don't forget the money. Throw out the door. Blood is running out of your body, Roach. You're yeah. Gonna be dead soon. Yeah. Don't listen to him. He's just that's scared. A, no, that's exactly what's happening. You've lost so much blood that you're not staying warm anymore. What is Bodie's plan at this point? Like, really? Tell him to release Tyler. Yes, release Tyler. Oh, she served her purpose. Do it, man. You owe me that much. I agree with him. He's not going to do it. Just let the like, pull the chute as he drops. Now we gotta land the plane and track everybody down and hopefully they let Tyler go. What are you doing? What? Did he just he just jump out of the plane without a friggin' parachute? He's insane. Oh, he's got a parachute on. You can tell. <laughs> they put it under his big shirt. Yeah, he is crazy. Yeah. Do it. Swear to God, I will. Do it. Oh, Jesus. Six seconds. Oh, my God. Pull it. Hold on. Oh, God. There goes his knee for sure. So is Roach. Roach is dead. And there goes all the money with him. They're both insane. God damn, you are one radical son of a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> he is. Well, he's not screaming, so maybe his knee's not that effed up. I'm out of here, Johnny. Ah! Yeah, no, he did mess his knee up. Looks like this time you won't be getting your man. Let's go! There you go, let her go. Doesn't have a lot of clothes on. Oh, he saved her. Daddy, I... Some other time. Yeah, some other time. Howard, what are you celebrating for? Everybody's dead. I'll see you in the next life! Go get your money. So we got what? Four, three, four, five people dead? Six people dead because of this? Potentially one of the worst storms in Australia's history. Oh, we're in Australia for the 50 year storm. He's not in prison? How? We're gonna try and track him down to where the 50 year storm is supposed to be, right? The huge wave? Death on a stick out there, mate. Death on a stick. Big waves. Bodie. Oh, oh, he knows it's him. I knew I could count on you. Got a passport of yours in Sumatra. Missed you by about a week in Fiji. Wow. But I knew you wouldn't miss a 50-year storm, Bodie. 
We knew where it was going. People trusted you and they died. Yeah, it went bad. It, you bet it did. Still surfing? Every day. Oh. It's time to go. Sorry, my friend. He's not gonna go. Oh, there we go. One's got a wetsuit on, the other one's got jeans and a jeans jacket. Patrick, I think, is a bit of a better fighter. Oh. Ow. I'll take the wind out of ya. Ooh, nice. That was a good one. Bodie's winning for sure. He's gonna kill him. No. Oh no, handcuffs. I told them you go quietly. Oh yeah, Australian police. You know there's no way I can handle a cage, man. It's gotta be that way. Oh my God. Look at that wave. Holy cow. Lots of police. I'm screwed. I'm gonna go to jail and I'll pay and Johnny Utah gets his guy. Oh, he kind of. Yeah, let me get one wave before you take me. Don't let him go. Come on, compadre. They can see he's copped, I'm sure. How would you even get out to it? Vaya con Dios. Goodbye. Bye, my friend. You let him go! No, I didn't. Yeah, he didn't let him go. Where's he gonna go? Those are massive waves. We'll get him when he comes back in! He's not coming back. Oh, he didn't make the wave at all. No. Boom. Is he gonna get killed from the undercurrent? Oh, guess we're not FBI anymore. Wow. Okay, well, let's talk about it. That was amazing. That was point break and talk about a, an adrenaline rush. Holy cow. Just, it just non-stop. It just went and went and went. So, hold on. So, I, I know Keanu Reeves from, um, I watched him in, what was the first thing I watched him in? Matrix. And then I saw John Wick 1 and 2. And then I saw, uh, what's the one with the bus? Speed. I don't think I've seen him anything else. Maybe I have. And then Patrick Swayze, I've just seen him in Ghost. And then the other cop, the cop that got killed, the, um, his partner, was from Lethal Weapon. He was a nut job in Lethal Weapon. Holy crow, was he a nut job. And then I also knew the boss of the FBI, who was the same boss in Office Space. And what a jerk he is in both of them. Oh my God, is he such a jerk? I think that's the same guy. Let me know in the comments if I'm right or wrong. Um... What else? Thank you so much to Steph for this private request. This movie's amazing. I really loved it. Would you have let it go at the end? I don't think I would have let him go. I would think I would have let him rot in prison. <laughs> I think that would have been a better way to go. More of like, you know, I don't know. He did get his man, but if he's going to give up in the FBI anyways, and he doesn't care if he got his man, but he's the Brody's end up going to be fish food. Yeah, I, I don't know that he ever got... If he did come back in to land, he was a dead body. But, um, yeah. I feel bad for Tyler in this whole situation. She's going to have some emotional issues and, and, you know, mental issues after that. Jeez. Really, really good movie. Really enjoyed it. Yeah. Loved it. Loved it, loved it. Man. So thank you so much to everybody for watching and make sure you like and subscribe if you enjoyed the reaction and check out my Patreon. All my full reactions are over there on Patreon as well as exclusive content like the entire series of Breaking Bad. I'm two seasons through um, The Sopranos. I think I have a full season of Stranger Things out there. Uh, True Detective is out there. So yeah, but um, it was... This was great. Really, really enjoyed it. So, yeah. Huh. Thank you so much for watching. I very much appreciate it. And as always, never forget that you are awesome. Thanks for watching. Bye.